Good evening, teacher. Hello, Alfa. Good evening. Teacher, le quería hacer una cosa. Yo ahora me quise meter a la plataforma y me tiene nada que ver con la plataforma seguir haciendo las tareas. No sé qué habrá pasado. Pero, eh, perdón. Eh, han cambiado la Ah, no, es que sabe que pusieron, recuerdo que le pusieron un mensaje a ellos que como que iba a estar deshabilitada este día. Ah, Ajá, ah. recuerdo que, que mencionaron algo en el grupo de WhatsApp. Ya sea por eso, pero espero que durante la semana ya ustedes puedan. Ah, porque no he terminado. Sí, sí. Yo quise avanzar hoy. Pero... Creo que fue. Entonces, hasta el... Sí, solo este día creo que va a estar así. Déjeme ver en el WhatsApp, creo que lo pusieron. Usted no está en el grupo. Eh, hasta ahora me agregaron. Ah, mire, pues sí. Sí, quizás le agregaron tarde porque lo pusieron a las nueve y media. Veamos, se les dan por este medio. ¿Cuándo? Sí, como que no tienen una fecha todavía. No está disponible, dice, por problemas técnicos. Ah, ok. Ajá, se les estará notificando por este mismo medio. Voy a volver a mandar el mensaje para que lo pueda ver, quizás. Ah, claro. Ajá. Sí, porque oh. yo me temí, yo qué raro, porque no me sale la página. Sí, puede ser que sea eso, fíjense. Déjeme ver. ¿Cuánto, cuan, ¿Cuándo termina este módulo, Ticha? Fíjese que, recuerdo que termina la otra semana, la otra semana, me parece. Eh, creo que martes o miércoles. Ah, okay. ok, permítame. Le voy a mandar el mensaje otra vez. Gracias, ah, uh -huh. Ahí está. Gracias. Ahí está. Ok. Ok, guys. Hello, everybody. Just, I hope you are okay. Welcome back. Good evening, everybody. Good to see you. Okay, we were talking about the last days, right? If I'm not wrong, this course ends next week, right? Let me just see the date that we are going to, uh, to end. Let me solo confirmar the date. If I'm not wrong, I think it is going to be next Wednesday. Look, it's the próximo Wednesday, but let me check. Let me check the dates. Last thing. Mm. No, maybe I don't have them. No, but um, Tuesday or Monday we we finish the course. Module two, right? Okay, let's go back to the lesson. And uh, remember, we were studying the participles, right? Some adjectives. And uh, yesterday, we had a task, right? So let's do this one first. Maybe you have questions so we can clarify them. So let's see, Mario, did you, did you come yesterday, Mario? Were you here in the class yesterday? Excuse me, mm -hmm. repeat, please. Okay, were you in the class yesterday, Mario, or no? Yes, yes. Okay, did you complete this part? Um, yes, um, uh, the B. Okay, can you help me with that one, please? Letter B, please help yes. me. Mm -hmm. She's wearing in the red dress. She is wearing in the Red dress. Mm -hmm. She is the woman. The woman? The woman. She is the woman. Or she is the one, too. We can add one. Mm -hmm. She is the one wearing. She is the one or she is the woman? We can say both. Both are okay. Las dos son correctas. Okay. She's the one or she is the woman. Wearing the red dress. In the red dress. The, the, red, the red dress? The red dress. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. The red dress. Las dos, both, it's okay. 
but in this case, nos están pidiendo que utilicemos one or once, right? Ah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But woman, podemos también, she's the woman wearing the red dress. It's, mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, Mario. So let's go with number two. Can you help me? Uh, let's see, Jonathan, can you help me with number two? Who are your neighbors? We have to use which, right? Sorry, teacher, ya no un poquito de perdidas que ayer sí no me pude conectar el país. Disculpar, tuve un problema. Okay, okay, Jonathan. Maybe you can try. This was the topic that we studied this week. So maybe you can check and try this. Okay, let's do. Okay, okay Marina, help me, please. Thank you. Okay, uh, two, the two. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, a ver si le dice William. Which one are your neighbors? Mm -hmm. That's right. Which ones are your neighbors? Mm -hmm. Which ones are your neighbors? Um, I can't answer. No, okay. So I don't have the question mark. I'm gonna modify this later. Okay, go ahead, please. What is the, the next one? Mm -hmm. And the answer? Which ones are the answers? Yes, please, letter B. Uh, they, are the, they are the people working with the baby. Mm -hmm. They are the people or another option, Morena? With the baby. Instead of using people, they are the people working. Okay, I don't want to use people. What is another word that I can um, use? One. Once. That's right. They are the ones. Mm -hmm. They are the ones working. Walking, perfect. With the baby. With the baby. That's it. We can use both. It's correct. Okay. But we are practicing one or once. Okay. Perfect, Morena. Thank you. Okay. So, uh, can you help me, please, Amanda? Do you have number three, Amanda? Three. Which one is Jeff? Which one? Yeah. Which one is Jeff? Mm -hmm. okay. And answer, mm -hmm. he, he is the man with glasses, or he is the one? Both, with... the dos están bien, both. He is the one, he is the one with glasses, right? Or también the other option. He is the man, he is the man with glasses. Mm -hmm. That's right. Okay, any question guys about this part? Mm -hmm. No questions? Okay, remember that this part, it is about the participles and the uh, prepositions, right? So that part we study in this week. Okay, so let's move. Can I move to the next slide? Well, continue, guys. Can I continue? Yep. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Let's move on to the activities we have for today. Okay, so I brought this reading for you to practice vocabulary and for you to practice too. Uh, pronunciation. So who wants to read this text? We are going to talk about social networking, right? Website. Las redes eh, sociales, right? Los, los de internet. Okay. So somebody who wants to read, remember this is for you to practice. Mm -hmm. Somebody? Richard. Uh -huh. Una consulta de la, uh -huh. eh, de la lámina anterior. Ya, yeah, tell me. Este, cuando decimos, él es el hombre. Uh -huh. He is the one, he is the man. Uh -huh. eh, y lo sustituimos por one. Ya, como, que, ¿cómo se pronuncia, cómo se traduce the, the one? 
Es el que o es él. El, es uh -huh. él. Es él. Por ejemplo, he's the one. El que está usando. Pero he's todo. El he is the man. Ah, no. He's he the, is one. the one. Where es él. Es el que. Ah, es el que. Uh -huh. Es el, es el que usa. Es el que usa lentes. El we. He's the, man, he's the one. Es el que. Usa los lentes. Ah, le decía, mm, usa los lentes. Con, pero que no le íbamos a sustituir con. Es el, el, es el que tiene lentes. Oui. En este caso podemos mm, cambiarlo oui. por has. Is the one wearing glasses. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He is. He is. Sí, nos quedaría. He is the one wearing glasses. Pero en el otro caso que teníamos with, uh -huh. sería he is. The man with, right, with glasses. Es el chico con lentes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ayer nos decía usted de que hay uno que no cambia. Yo no sé si es con el hard. El, cuando se usa con chiji, no sé, se me viene la... No sé, ah, no me... ese es, mm, pero en este caso estamos utilizando el verbo to be. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ajá, el verbo to be que nos decía que en, en ellos no cambia. Ah, entonces ese es el verbo, si lo entendí, si lo entendí bien, es el verbo tener, ¿verdad? Ajá. Hijas. Uh -huh. Ajá. Él tiene. Hijas. Ajá, él tiene. Hijas. Ajá, correcto, pero con ellos siempre va a ser has o hi, her. Ah, ok. Vamos a utilizar ha, eh, has con she en it. Ah, en tercera uh -huh. persona. Sí. En con... uh, have... Vamos a utilizar con I, you, we y they. Ok. Ok. Thank you, teacher. Sí. Perfect. Okay, let's continue. So we have uh, the. We have here this reading prep. Who wants to read, guys, this section? Mm -hmm. Volunteers? Me teacher. Okay, perfect, Gloria. Thank you. Okay, let's start. Um, sometimes social networking websites are for sending new messages mm -hmm. and photos to friends. They are like bit uh, bulletins, bulletin boards on the internet. Now social networking with site mm -hmm. are for work too. Mm -hmm. When employed, people can find jobs. There are companies can find new workers. Some she also has a lot of very useful information about job and um, careers. Career. Okay, let's, vamos, we're going to repeat websites. Web. Mm -hmm. Websites. Website. Tenemos en unemployed. Unemployed. Teacher, teacher, mm -hmm. y ¿cómo se pronuncia? Sites, sites. Sites, sites. 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 Yes, sites. Mm -hmm. Unemployed. Then, okay, this is unemployed. Unemployed. Okay, luego tenemos useful. 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 That's right. Useful. Okay, unemployed means alguien que está desempleado, right? Desempleado, sin trabajo, without a job. Sin trabajo, right? Job. Tenemos los sitios, right? Websites, los sitios web. And useful information. Useful information Ooh. es información útil. En alguna utilidad, right? Very useful information. Okay, any other word about that paragraph? ¿Alguna otra palabra, guys, about the paragraph? 
-huh. eh, me, 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 ¿Cómo es mensaje, teacher? ¿Cómo es pronunciado? Message. Message. Uh -huh. Message. Message. Yeah. Message. Okay. Message. Thank you. Message. Mm -hmm. Any other? Mm -hmm. Any other guys? Okay, so let's continue with the next paragraph. Who wants to read this one? Yeah, teacher. Okay, thank you, Amanda. You can start. Okay. Okay. Here is the story. Here is the story of two people who use jobs as social networking website. Continue. Julia, Julia is a hardworking student at a large community college. She's very busy with her course, but she is also ambitious. Her career goal is to be an accountant. She has a profile on a social 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 networking website for business professionals. Her profile has a link to her resume. No sé yes. cómo se dice. Resume, that's right. Okay, these words, estas palabras, we're going to use them mostly when we are talking about business, right? Negocios. Yes. Okay, vamos a ver each word. Hard, okay. Let's see a word. Okay, this is social, social, right? Social. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, esta, this word, esta letra tiene dos pronunciaciones. You can say A or you can say A. Both are okay, but most American, they say this one as A, a social networking. Okay, you can say A too, but if you want to sound like more American, they say a. a, a. Then we have hard working. What is hard working, guys? Who knows this word? Hard, hard. working? Mm -hmm. What is hard working? What is? Okay, let's go to your dictionaries. Let's go to your dictionary. Mm -hmm. But what is hard working? Hard work. That's right. Trabajadora, una persona. Efficient, right? Trabajadora, perseverante. That is a hardworking person. What about uh, busy? Busy. Busy. busy? busy. What is this one? Busy. Ocupada. Ocupada, ocupado. That's right. Then we have ambitious. 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 Yes. That's right. Ambitious. ambitious. Then we have profile. Mm. Profile, what is profile, guys? For example, if you have Facebook, that is your profile, or maybe LinkedIn también is that your profile. Perfil. That's right, super feel right, on social networking. Then we have business. Negocios. Negocios, that's right. Negocios, professional, right? Mm -hmm. Then we have resume, what is the word resume? What is resume. that? A curriculum. resume. The curriculum is, is yes. longer, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But this one is como, uh, hay dos tipos, si no estoy eh, equivocada, está el currículum y está el resume. El resume is shorter, es más pequeño, right? Mm -hmm. El resume, one page, two, mostly. <clears throat> okay, so any questions about uh, this paragraph? Any word, guys? No, okay. So let's go with the next paragraph. Who wants to read it? Somebody, guys? Mm -hmm. No, no one, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna read this one. It says, it says, Ricardo is an employer. He has a small business. His accounting office needs a new accountant. He's interested in Julia's profile on Jobs Link. 
she's young, but she's an excellent student. Ricardo contacts Julia by email. She has an interview with Ricardo. He thinks that Julia is friendly and smart. So Julia has a new job. Julia and Ricardo are happy with the social networking website. Questions or any word about this paragraph related to this paragraph, guys? Interview. Interview, it is like la entrevista, right? When you have an interview to find a job. That is the interview. Jobs link era lo que decía del, del jobs job link. It is el enlace, right? De su de su perfil. Por lo menos algunos tienen perfiles, profiles en LinkedIn. No sé si han escuchado de esa LinkedIn, esa donde usted eh, pica ahí su carrera. That is like that. Job link. Mm -hmm. Employer. Employer, it is le, el, el que da el trabajo, right? El employer. Employee es el que trabaja para esa persona. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo Por decirlo así, reclutador. Mm, no. Ok, I'm going to write it here. Tendría que ser empleador. Empleador, that's right. Empleador. And the other one is el trabajador, right? Mm -hmm. Employee, oh, I'm sorry. Employee. That one is the one that I told you, right? El empleado. Mm -hmm. This one is like the boss, let's say. Esto lo van a escuchar a lot. If you go, for example, in an interview, uh, they are going to talk about uh, some characteristics you have, you may have for a new job. Okay, so um, no questions? No. Very teacher. useful, very useful. Okay, so let's only remind the vocabulary. Vamos a revisar the vocabulary. What is the meaning of hard working, guys? What is the meaning of hard working? What does that mean? What does the, ¿qué significa? What is the meaning of hard working? Trabajadora, trabajadora. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about the word friendly? Friendly. Mm -hmm. What is friendly? Friendly. What is friendly, guys? So. Amigable. Amigable. Amigable, that's right. Then we have the word unemployed. Unemployed. Mm -hmm. What is unemployed? Desempleado. Desempleado, that's right. Okay, maybe. And what about this word, resume? Resume. Esa es como la palabra también que se utiliza en español. That is no. It's because no. we no, we have two. Two here. Tenemos the, the curriculum, right? We have the curriculum. Y we have the resume. resume. This, this um, one is longer. This is más largo, right? Ah, uh, resume. Como un resumen. De yes. Curriculum. One page. Una hoja de vida. Mm -hmm. Very simple in one page. Ahora, si usted está buscando trabajo, they are looking for some resumes. They ask a lot. Tendría que ser la hoja de vida. Mm, no, but shorter, but más pequeña, sí. Sería. Es como una página. Y ese es el nombre, incluso aquí en, el, sí. en español. Sí, pues yes. sí porque con currículo igual. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sí, de hecho así está. If you look for it, resumen, resumen, reseña, it says the meaning. Teacher. Mm -hmm. eh, eh, eh. Is cover letter resume? Oh no, cover letter. It is like, a, for example, it is like an essay about your profile. The cover letter. Some mm -hmm. jobs ask for a cover letter. Mm -hmm. It is like a, 
estamos escribiendo como un ensayo de su vida, de lo que usted ha hecho, about what you want, but this uh, a description, right? That is the cover letter. Some companies ask you for that, but in El Salvador, not too much. As far as I know, maybe some that have, may, may have changed. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So let's continue. Uh, this is uh, so interesting, right? Talking about jobs in vocabulary. Okay, so let's move on to the next activity. And uh, we are going to have a video activity, right? So give me just a second to share with you this video. Then we discussed this part. See? Okay, can you see what what can you see? Can you see the video, guys? Podemos ver, can you see the video? Una pantalla negra. Oh, yes. And in other news, two prisoners escaped from the state prison this morning. They are traveling in a dark SUV. These men are dangerous and have guns. The governor says suspicion. Sarah, would you like another cup of coffee? No, thanks. Honey, do we know anyone that has an SUV? An SUV? The Thompsons have an SUV, a green one. This one's not green. It's not? What color is it? I can't tell. It's, it's red or brown. It's dark. Where is it? It's parked in front of the house, and there are two people inside. Really? Mm-hmm. And now they're getting out of it. What do they look like? One man's tall, and he's got dark hair, and he's wearing sunglasses. And how about the other one? He's short. He's wearing a baseball cap and sunglasses, too. I think they're coming here. Sarah, you keep watching. I'm gonna call the police. The police? Why are you calling the police? There was a news report on the radio a moment ago. Two men escaped from the state prison this morning. They're dangerous and they have guns. They're traveling in a dark SUV. Well, hurry up, go call the police. Oh. Yes, I'd like to report two suspicious persons. 353 Elm Road, Salem. George Adams, A-D-A-M-S. What are they doing now? They're standing in the driveway and they're looking around. They're standing in the driveway looking around. About how old are they? Can you tell? The short one is about 20. The short one's about 20. And the tall one looks like he's in his 40s. And the tall one looks like he's in his 40s? George, they're walking up to the front door. It's all right, Sarah. Help us on the way. Yes, thank you so, so much. Bye. Wait a minute. I can see them now. George, the tall one is... Cousin George. So this is the right address. <laughs> it's been so long, I wasn't sure I remembered. Cousin <laughs> Harry, what are you doing here? We were passing through town, so we decided to stop in and say hello. Last time you saw my daughter Alexis here, she was just a baby. Hi. <laughs> Alexis, look at you. You're all grown up. It is great to see you both. Come on in. Wow, sounds like a rough neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, what can you tell me to, um, what can you tell me about this video? Is it like something that, that you do, for example, when you see something strange in your neighborhood? Or what do you do when you are in danger, for example? 
Mm -hmm. What do you do? What do you do when you feel that something, that there is a problem? What do you do? Um, let's see, Jonathan, in your case, for example, when, when you see something strange uh, in your neighborhood, what do you do? Mm -hmm. What do you do, uh, Jonathan? Cuando vea peligro, when you see something that it is dangerous. Are you there, Jonathan? No? Okay, what about um, you, Jonathan? What do you do? Not. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, Jonathan? Okay, what about uh, you, um, let's see, Gloria? What do, you, what do you do, Gloria? Yes, look, yes, usted, when you see, for example, that it is, that there is danger, hay peligro, what do you do? Teacher sería que the doors locker. Oh, keep the doors locker, it can be, right? Keep the doors locked. Yes, right. And we call the police. Do you call the police? Call the police, yes. Call the police, right? Call the police. Okay, so we see, we have here that, for example, in the US, in North America, sometimes uh, people do these things. They keep their doors locked, right? Cierran las puertas, locked. Las bloquean también. Leave lights on when they go out. Do you do this, guys? Leave your lights. Dejar las luces encendidas, right? When you go out. <laughs> Run. <laughs> Run. <laughs> yes, and run. We adopt the world, the and, home. Yeah, and have a dog, right? Okay, and then we have the other one. And the, the one that says I have a P, a P full. What is a P full? Okay, a P full, it, it is like uh, the person that, or the, when you are seeing like, uh, ustedes ven en la, there is a hole in la puerta. Yes, this one, this one, this one, that one. Or there is a, a big a thing there and you start like, Thing, what is there? That is the peep, the people, right? Then we have have an alarm system. That is too expensive, right? Tener una alarma? Yeah, I think it is expensive. That makes noise if someone tries to open a door or a window. Mm, no, uh, I don't know, but it's too expensive. Or buy a dog. Do you have dogs to guard their home? What about you? Do you have dogs? Yes. To guard your your house? Yes, you have. Yes. Okay. And sometimes the dogs don't say nothing, right? <laughs> 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 okay, yes, that, that, that happens right here. So we have which types of neighborhoods have more crime in your country? Which type of neighborhood? ¿Cuáles son como los lugares vecindarios that have more crime? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mejor no decir. <laughs> <laughs> it is better not to say that, right? So we have the rural areas or the cities or suburbs, right? How do people protect their homes in our country? ¿Cómo las protegen? How do people protect? Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo se dice? Colocan cámaras de video. Okay, they, it can be an alert system, right? With cameras. Mm -hmm. With cameras, right? They record. Mm -hmm. that, that is too expensive too, right? Okay, yes. Okay, so based on the video, right? Let's answer this section. Vamos a responder. We're going to answer this section. Okay, the first picture, the first picture. Okay, what is the order of the of the of the video? We have number one, Sarah is writing and George is pouring coffee. So what's what is going to be picture two? Can you tell me? Here you have the sentences. 
Mm -hmm. What is the, the, the second sentence? ¿Cuál sería la segunda picture, guys? Mm -hmm. What is the, the second one? Here you have the sentence. The divisor are, are eating all oh. of the sub. SUV, right? SUV. SUV. The visitors are getting out of the SUV, right? Yes. Okay, yes. Picture, picture two. Picture two, right? The visitors, visitors are getting out, right? Getting out of the... That is number two, yeah. What about number three? What about number three? George is coming. You is a call the police. George? Okay. Mm -hmm. What is... George is, George calling, is calling the police. George is calling George. the police. Yes, George is calling George the police, right? The police. the police. Okay, and what about number four? Number four. Mm -hmm. Four. 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 Mm -hmm. four. Mm -hmm. outside the USD. Oh, okay. I hear someone says the visitors, right, are visitor. standing mm -hmm. standing outside the USB. Yes, yeah. right. The visitors are standing out, right? Are standing outside, están afuera, right? Outside. Okay, what about the next one, number four? Sara. Sara is looking, Sarah Sarah is is looking, looking at the <laughs> Yes. Okay. Eso me recuerda, that reminds me of a lady that lives in my neighborhood, that she is watching all the time what is happening in the street. I don't know if you know someone like her. <laughs> Pero no, eh, nunca faltan, right? Nunca faltan. <laughs> nunca faltan. Que están pendientes de todo. <laughs> no, but that is good, right? They, they can call the police when they see something, when she sees something. See, number four. Sara is looking, right? That is Sara is looking at the UB. Okay, and... What about the last one? What about the last one? Sarah. Sarah and George. Sarah and George are greeting the visitor. The visitor. They are visitors. Visitor. Okay. Sarah and George. And George, and George are, are greeting. 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 How does it pronounce? Greeting. 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 Their visitor. visitors, yes. Okay, there you have. Okay, there you have most of the sentences. Okay. Okay, yes, that is a typical uh, part of here, right? Okay, let's finish with this section, guys. Vamos a terminar. We're going to finish this part about the listening, right? Remember that you are going to listen and you're going to write the words that are missing here. Okay, questions about the activity? Yes. Okay. Yes, tell me. Mm -hmm. No questions? Okay, so let's go to the breakout rooms and uh, you're going to be working in this activity. Just a second. Okay, I'm gonna give you 10 minutes, right? Then we're going to have the answer of this. So,
Hello, Alpha. Oh. Hello, Alpha. Let's see what happened, guys. Hello, Alpha. Hello. Hola, Alpha.
otra, sí o no. Lo vamos a meter otra vez. No hay quien, quien nos diga. Do you have questions, guys? Or everything is good? Hello? Yes, teacher. Ok, parece que se nos fue Morena. Ok. Do you have questions, José? Yes, teacher, es que vaya, eh, lo que entendimos es que íbamos a contestar lo de que mandó al WhatsApp, es a como, como complementar las oraciones. El script. Uh -huh. eh, y las, prácticamente la, la respuesta nosotros las tomaría de lo que nos acordamos del video. No, no, se los compartí también, también se los compartí. Ah, en el link. Sí, sí. Ah, ok, ok, ahí es donde no entendíamos. Uh -huh. Sí, ahí está el enlace. Conforme ah. al video, ¿se recuerda del video? Ahí está. Ah, sí, sí, sí. ¿Ah? Sí, sí. Sí, esa era la, como la, la interrogante que teníamos. Ok, ok. So, start working. We have like, a, let's see, like four minutes, right? Ok. Hello, Morena. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Yo no hay que hacer. <laughs> Ok, remember. No, no entendí de dónde vamos a sacar la respuesta. Les compartí el enlace en in the WhatsApp. So, uh -huh. you to copy that link and watch the video. It is the same as the way. Ah, watch. está el video aquí. Ahí está, yes. Ah, ah pues es el que lo vimos. Ok, let me just. <laughs> and then you can try, ok. Vamos a intentar, can you try? to join the group okay. Okay. Hello, guys do you have questions or everything is okay hello estamos bien Gladys and Antonias este, este, aquí donde dice que George pregunta, Sara, would you like another cup, cup of? Vale. Aquí es, de llenar aquí es poner que, que George le está ofreciendo otra taza de café. Ok, eh, tenemos el enlace del video, Gladys. Tenemos el enlace del video. Eh, tengo solamente, tengo la pantalla what do you, what do you say? Uh -huh. en el grupo de whatsapp les compartí un enlace tienen que ir a ese enlace ver el video nuevamente y con base al video usted responde esa parte uh -huh. Sí, yo tengo esa parte que eh, George is, is getting the policy would you like another cup Of, ok, déjenme ver si lo puedo compartir. Eh, voy, a, voy a suspender acá que comparta para que podamos ver esa parte del video. ¿Sí, Gladys? Ok. Ok. A ver. okay recordemos la primera frase que era Would you like... Would you like another cup of? Cup. Encontrar esa palabra, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Do you, do you yes. like? Okay. ¿Pueden, ver mi pan? ¿Pueden ver el video? Can you see the video, guys? Okay. Sí. Sí, ok. Vamos a clic. And in other news, two prisoners escaped from the state prison this morning. They are traveling in a dark SUV. These men are dangerous and have guns. The governor says suspicion. Sarah, would you like another cup of coffee? Okay, what is the word they say? ¿Cuál es la palabra que dicen? Would you like another cup of? Coffee. That's right. And then, hacemos lo mismo, right? That's it. You're going to listen the video and copy the answers. That's right. Ok, no more questions. Okay. Questions or can I let you work? No questions, Gladys? Are we okay? No questions. No questions. Ok,
Hi, Morena, did you finish? Hello there. Hello. Muy poco tiempo, Liz. <laughs> Soy de gemelo de deber. <laughs> How many words do you have? How many words? ¿Cuántas palabras? How many words do you have? Es bien poquita. Solo llegué al do it. Al <laughs> coffee. Es que... El y el video no veía la, lo, el otro. <laughs> Hasta el coffee llegamos. No, el coffee do with it. How do you do? Okay, don't worry. We're going to, to we're going to try to finish with, with your classmates. Let's see how far they gone. Okay, guys, tell me, Amanda, how many words did you have? How many words did you get, Amanda? Eh, ¿Qué? ¿Cuántas palabras? How many words? Ah, hice. ¿Mm? A ver, ¿Cuántas palabras? Si las iba enumerando. Uh -huh. 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh, 20, that's a lot, right? Ok, what about um, you, uh, Jolman? How many words did you get? Uh -huh. How many words? Jolman? Okay, what is the first one, guys? What is the primera palabra? What is the first word? Coffee. Coffee, right? <laughs> Coffee. The only one. <laughs> the next one, what is then the next word? No. No things. Okay, no things, right? Uh -huh. No things. Then we have honey. Uh -huh. Honey. To be, to be is to be es la entendí. Uh -huh. What is it? Who? Okay. Honey. Hey, honey. To be, we know. To we know. Do, okay, yes, right. Nice, do, do. Do, do. 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 we know? Do, do we? Uh-huh. Do. Uh -huh. do we know? Do we know? Some, some. In this one, do we know one? Um, one, no, one, one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do we have? Do we know anyone who has an SUV? Mm -hmm. And uh, what about the next one? How? Oh. Next one, the Thompsons have, yes, muy bien. And uh, then an SUV, a? Uh? Green. Yeah, a green, a green one. Then we have? One. Red. Mm -hmm. Red. Brown. This is, oh, brown. this is not green. Red or oh, brown. Mm -hmm. it's, it's right. It's not this. Um, not it's not. It's not. What? What is the next one? What is la palabra? What is the word? What? What color? What color? Yes. What color is it? And then I can. I can't, right? I can't. I can't. Me van a disculpar por este curly bracket, pero no tengo el apóstrofe. I now. Parece que se me escondió. It's red or brown. It's dark. It's dark, right? It's dark. Okay. It's dark. What about George? Where is it? Yeah, where is it? Mm -hmm. It's parked in front of the house. House. Muy bien. Okay, and the... and the oh guys, I'm sorry, I will have to end the class, guys, because I have another one. <laughs> sorry, tomorrow we're going to check this. And uh, thank you so much for coming, guys. Hope to see you tomorrow.
Okay, teacher. Bye, teacher. See you guys. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye.